Hey everyone, welcome to Cricut Time. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button for more project ideas and tutorials. Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you a nice and easy tutorial on how to use the slice tool. What we're going to do is take a monogram and slice it in half so that we can put in the last name. If you aren't familiar with Design Space yet, over on the left side you're going to see images. There are endless ideas in here and you can choose if you want to do something that is free or something that is paid. For today I'm just going to scroll down and find an M that I like. Once you find the one you like, just go ahead and click on it and press insert. So I'll just make this a bit bigger so you can see it. I'll just make it a different color so it's easy to see here. What we're going to do next is we're going to insert a square. So over on the left here where it says shapes, pick a square. You're going to unlock it and that's going to let you change it to any size you want. So what we're going to do is just make sure that it is wide enough to fill the whole picture. And then just move it to the middle. And just make sure the height is big enough to put your text. So that'll depend on you if you're going to use a tall text or a skinny text. But this looks good. So what I'm going to do is over on the right, we have to click both layers. So you're going to click square and click M monogram. Select both of them. And then down at the bottom, just under blank canvas, it says slice. So go ahead and click that. So what this did was take out a rectangle out of the M, which gives us room to put the name in. So what we're going to do now is we're just going to pull out everything in the middle and just delete it. So again, I've just deleted everything that was in the middle. So now what we're going to do is go in and add a shape again. We'll pick a square. And I'll just switch the color to match the M. I'm going to unlock it. And then just drag it down. And what we're going to do is we're going to turn this into a really skinny, long rectangle. And that's going to make the line that goes on the top of our monogram name. So once you're happy with it, just line it up so it's centered. Use the little grid lines there to help you. Then you're just going to copy and paste. Now you've got two lines that are the exact same size. And again, just line it up. I'm just using those little grid lines to help me align it perfectly. And that looks good. So now what we can do is go in and add our text. And you can put your last name in there or the client that you're doing. Just go ahead and put in your name. And I'm just lining up the little X in the middle to the middle of my monogram. Now the one thing I've noticed with this is I don't like the spacing between all the letters. So highlight the text and then at the top click ungroup. So what this is going to do is it's going to separate each letter into its own little picture and you can drag them around. So I'm going to leave the E where it is because it's centered and I'll just pull over the other letters and just line them up nice. And done. Once you add in your last name, you'll have your own personalized monogram. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Cricut Time. If you liked this video, remember to subscribe and hit the like button. Videos come out twice a week with project ideas and tutorials on how to do all things Cricut.